Hey, hey guys, this is Jahid from Apex Recipe. In today's tutorial, we will compare the following topics with JavaScript data type using tools for coding and printing output. Remember one thing when PLSQL maintain undefined and null values with just null JavaScript distinct those data types number string and boolean are the same as plsql data type and javascript has some objects object date array and functions we will dis we will discuss these topics in this series later plsql using a tools for code you know and you are very familiar with these tools and javascript using a lot of tools for coding uh, I have just mentioned these four in this presentations dbms output dot put line is uses to print output in PLSQL and if you are an Oracle Apex developer then you know stp dot p uses in PLSQL dynamic content for printing output on the other hand, JavaScript uses console.log, document.write, and alert. If you don't want to miss next video, then subscribe to this channel. In the next immediate video, we will compare the arithmetic operators with JavaScript. You know about the printing output of PLSQL. Let's see JavaScript printing output. In this case, I just use Google Chrome browser. So don't be late. Let's go. For JavaScript coding, just click the right from mouse, then inspect, then click source then go to snippets then take a new snippet I am naming this first code and on the right side you have an editor section then you write document dot write I am writing apex recipe for this output and then control enter for seeing the output in in the document dot write you have seen the output in the body of this space <coughs> let's see the console dot log console dot log I am printing Apex recipe again. Then control alert, alter. I am seeing this output on the console at the bottom of this page. And then I am just write alert for printing an alert same I am writing apex recipe then control enter and here is the alert and the previous apex recipe is printed again and apex recipe from this console log again and you already have the alert In, in the document dot write if you want to write HTML code then then you have to use double string I'm writing apex recipe again then I, I am just use a break tag on the document dot write uh, first page first you have to reload this page 
and then run this code again I'm just run this code again then you see the break is applied that's all thank you for watching